What up, my ghetto mites? Welcome to another episode of Ghetto Bites. And today I have for you some Popeye's chicken. That's what we have right here. Let me go this a little further back so y'all can see. I got some chicken. And I got some Chicago dogs from this restaurant. I think it's called OG's. I got a biscuit. And I got some peppers with some Cajun rice with gravy on it. To drink, I have, oh, I have a Southern Up. That I'm going to mix with this green apple Everfresh. So, let me pour up. And then we can get this party started after I pray. Put a little bit of honey on this chicken, baby. It sure tastes good to me. Put some hot sauce on this chicken, baby. Yeah. It sure look good to me. Yeah. Mm. Y'all see it's quiet today. All oh, the kids are. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for this food that you have allowed us, me to receive. Lord God, I ask that it be nourishing to the body. Lord God, and I give you the glory, honor, and praise for it. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. All right. Let's bite into this Chicago dog. And I got a pepper on it. Let's show y'all everything. Everything. That's a good mixture. Oh. What's good with y'all? That's how you do that, you gotta squeeze that juice on it. Mm. How was our holiday? I 
Aha, pewnie już było. With you and with your family. I might say that for the shit. Why do you keep calling? Sorry, y'all. Sorry about that. But yes, them chillings is back to school. And I'm loving it. This other hot dog, I'm gonna say it for later. Girl, I really don't like the bread on here. Popeyes and we have been, been being about that stingy line. I went there and they had it signs or flyers plastered all over <laughs> the place like it was abandoned talking about the chicken sandwich will be back soon first and foremost Popeye how y'all Gonna make this little dry chicken sandwich. I don't care what nobody's saying. I had it. It was dry. Y'all on. Move in. With a sneak chicken sandwich. And then move out like a ninja. What kind of company are you? Y'all ain't selected up high. I got your number. Like that older lady said to Big Mama, uh, 
Big Mama's house, Lamar Lawrence. She said, I got you a penny changed. How you can change a penny? She's awesome. She's awesome for that. I got all these left on. I'm gonna do a mukbang on my leftovers yesterday. For the holiday. But I really wanna do a mukbang. Gone. On this mac and cheese I made, baby. Who I made this seafood mac and cheese. They're all my family members. That ate it. My God, they loved it. So, if you want to see the seafood mac and cheese, comment below and let me know. I got y'all. No. It ain't no lobster mac and cheese. Like everybody do. I did shrimp and crab mac and cheese. It was so good. I'm full. Sorry, y'all. I don't take much. Not no more. But. I'm gonna try. All gone. Been 14 minutes. Comment, like, subscribe, and share. Let me know if y'all want to see that seafood mac and cheese I made. This straw is acting on real right now. Let me know if y'all want to see that. Until then, now it's time to say goodbye to all my ghetto minds. 
G H E T T O M I T E S. Excuse me. I love you with the love of Christ. Also, I almost forgot. If you're looking for a church home and you are in the Racine and Kenosha area, please come and visit our church. It's called Axe Family Worship Center. And it's located at 5707 7th Avenue, downtown Kenosha. Also, if you are in the Milwaukee area and you're looking for a church home or you're looking to visit a church, please go check out Greater Bethlehem Temple at 222 East Center Street. All right. Love y'all with the love of the Lord. Mwah. All over again. Until the next time I see you.